Hi, and welcome to Catrin Figures. I'm your host, Caitlin, and today is not technically the day of all days. It's actually a little bit later than that, but Mark and I actually got stuck at our own individual jobs, so you know how that is when you get stuck at work quite a bit. But I do have my polls for you guys, so this is my pull box for this week. You know, pretty average week for me. So let's jump right on into it, shall we? First off from DC is Titans Annual 2. So, you know, Titans has been a really solid run for me. I know there's a bunch of shakeups going on with Justice League, Titans, and Teen Titans. So I would definitely look out for some of those titles that are coming up. Uh, also, Teen Titans issue 19. It ain't easy being green. So, you know. Don't piss off Beast Boy. Basically, story there. Uh, next, I did pick up the Superman variant cover for Teen Titans. I do kind of love this. I mean, it's definitely a callback to the new, the new Teen Titans issue one that came out in the 80s with the formation there. Definitely happy to have that. Next is Detective Comics issue 979. Really awesome cover there. Detective Comics, definitely been a must read from DC for me. Next is Wonder Woman issue 45. I can't remember if this is the last of the Ginny Frisian covers or one of the last ones. I know that Art Germ will be taking over the variant covers for Wonder Woman moving forward. So pretty excited about that. Jenny Frozian had a really, really solid run on the covers, but I'm also really excited about the art germ covers. Next is Trinity issue 22. I picked up this cover. My shop didn't even have the main cover. Trinity definitely read more like I wanted a Justice League to run, but you know, with the with the shakeups with the new teams and the new writing creation and everything, I'm really excited with the new Justice League outlook. So we'll see. We'll see. Uh, next, I picked up The Flash. This is issue 45. No, it is not the David Finch cover. The David Finch cover was trashed at my shop. I was kind of brokenhearted over that. But, you know, we move on. Next, I picked up Mara, Queen of Atlantis, issue three of six. So, been a fun run. Um, if you're not currently reading this, I would say probably wait for the trade. It's only a six mini. So, well, mini series. Uh, one cover that I think is probably my favorite. Uh, I'm back and forth between the, ne the next two covers. But that's Suicide Squad issue 40, the Superman cover. So, this is gorgeous. This is probably one of my favorite Suicide Squad variants we've had in a while since about the middle of Rebirth. Um, also, Justice League of America issue 29, the uh, variant for it, so that's pretty awesome. Also, I believe both of these are actually in Matina. I know this one is. I believe this one is. I don't know, I'm too lazy to look it up right now. So, so moving on into Marvel for this week, I picked up the uh, Adam Kubert Hunt for Wolverine variant. Um, I read through it. Am I going to pick up all of the tie-ins and the rest of the story, single issues while it comes out? Probably not. Um, it's just kind of like a, oh, hey, this is kind of what's going on, you know. Um, maybe in trade, if it ends up being good, I wasn't super impressed with issue one, so we'll see. Uh, continuing on into a Marvel story that I am loving, and that is Old Man Hawkeye issue four. So we all know I love, love, love Hawkeye. Um, fairly newer with... Uh, with Old Man Logan, but uh, Old Man Hawkeye, definitely been enjoying it. 
So continuing on into the indies for this week, I have Stabity Bunny issue four. This is an adorable slash slightly terrifying story. Um, don't piss off this bunny. You know, don't mess with this girl. Best things I can tell you there. Uh, continuing on, I picked up Mighty Morphin Power Rangers, ish, the uh, 2018 annual for Shattered Grid. So it's weird because I feel like they just had their last annual like a few months ago, but whatever, you know, if it's the Power Rangers, they can have as many annuals as they want. Uh, moving on, I picked up Animosity Evolution issue of five. So this is also in the same world as the main storyline, uh, animosity and animosity, the rise. So definitely if you're looking to delve more into that world, I would suggest this, but it's not for everyone. I'm really enjoying all three titles though. And the last book that I picked up was Ice Cream Man issue four. So I was torn between either the cover of him on the tandem with the skeleton behind him or the bar one. And I just thought this looked awesome. So, you know, I had to pick it up. So yeah, that's it for this new week in comics. Give me a like if you like this video, comment below and tell me some of the cool things that you picked up this week in comics. Tell me whether or not you think I missed out on anything. I am always looking out for good suggestions of new books. Uh, subscribe to my channel for more comic book content or check out any of the older videos I have up for offer here on Catrin Figures. And until next time, I'm your host, Caitlin. Bye.